one of my favorite snacks of all time. I have been eating this since I was a kid. You make it ahead of time. It stores in your fridge for two weeks and it is so delicious. But now I am finding out that most of you have not only never tried it, you've never heard of it. I'm Canadian and in Canada, this is what we call antipasto. Now I know everyone has a version of antipasto, but for some reason, ours is different. It's not the same. There is some chopping involved, so, oh my God. We're starting with sweet pickles. <laughs> One of those little Amazon choppy things would come in super handy right now, but I mean, also, I know, I, I, I can't cut, I know. Once you get them smaller, go in with a bigger knife and kind of chop them down. You want it like that size. Next up, pickled onions, drain the liquid and chop. Green olives, drain and chop. Should have mentioned, you need the pimento kinds, the kind with the little red things. In they go. Donated mushrooms, give them a chop. You need one tin of drained black olives. Chopping is done. Now you're gonna add two tins of tuna. It should be drained and rinsed. Spicy ketchup and chili sauce. Now, if you want low sugar, buy the no sugar added ketchup and add your own heat. Give it a really good mixing because you don't want chunks of tuna. You want it to be really blended. By the way, some people add anchovy. I am not an anchovy girl. Get yourself some mason jars. I have these ones linked to my Amazon shop because the lids are attached. I lose the lids. Do you not lose the lids? This will store in your refrigerator for up to two weeks. It is the best snack when you come home from work and you're starving. One last thing. Let it sit in the fridge for like an hour or two before you eat it because it all gets commingly and yummy and better the longer it sits. So good. Happy snacking.